superheroes are coming to the rescue. Who cares that they are just dolls? Our new video is all about how to make doll versions of Wonder Woman, Miraculous Ladybug, and Storm from the X-Men. <laughs> oh no! A thief stole my purse! Help! Calm down! My friend Ladybug will take care of it! Poor thief! He already regrets stealing the purse! Ladybug enters the ring! She's small, fast, and strong! Dip the head of an old doll in hot water to soften the rubber. Carefully remove the head. Put the head in hot water again to soften the glue. Use tweezers to remove the doll's hair. Put the head back on. Cover the head with plastic wrap and a wet wipe. Secure it on with rubber bands on the neck and hairline. Put Elmer's glue on the top part of the head. When the first layer dries, apply another layer. Make four to five layers of glue. Mark the edges of the wig with a pen. Remove the paper towel and trim it. Wrap dark blue yarn on a piece of cardboard five inches wide. Cut it on one side. Wrap the yarn around a pencil. Make tassels out of three strands each. Comb the threads using a special pet brush. Make it nice and fluffy. Straighten it with a flat iron. Trim the hair from the pencil and glue the edges with Elmer's glue. Once the glue dries, trim the uneven edge. Glue the strands onto the wig base. Use clear super glue. Start from the bottom. Make a side part. Tie two ponytails. Trim the bangs and the ponytails. Cover the doll's body with red acrylic paint. Cut a round stencil out of foam paper and draw black circles on the whole body using a permanent marker. Draw a collar with black acrylic paint. Cover the iris of the eyes with blue acrylic paint and paint her lips pink. Cut a mask out of foam paper. Color it with acrylic paint and attach it to the doll's face. Tie the ponytails with red satin ribbons. Make a purse out of light clay. Once the clay hardens, color it like a ladybug using acrylic paint. Super glue on a small cord. Put the purse on ladybug. I'm so sad. My purse had all my most important things in it. And here it is. I told you that Ladybug could handle it. Thanks, Ladybug. You really are miraculous. The girls are watching TV to see the weather forecast. They say that there will be a huge storm. Next thing you know, the wind will blow the weather lady away. Now we're in disaster mode. Storm from the X-Men is to blame. Cut off the doll's hair. Carefully remove the head so you don't damage the anchor fastening. Dip the head into hot water to soften the glue on the hair. Use tweezers to remove the glue from the inside and pull out the remains. Wipe the paint from the head with acetone. Pass thick white yarn through the holes on the head. Tie a knot and pull the yarn through. Create a snow white hairdo. Unpick the front threads. You get thin locks. Cut costume pieces from black stretchy fabric. Cut out a hole in the swimsuit and put it on through the neck. Put the head back. Fasten the top on the back with fabric glue. Put on the bottom piece and fasten it. Join the two parts of the suit with a jump ring. 
decorate the cape around the perimeter with a golden ribbon. Sew jump rings to the corners. Glue boot pieces together. Turn them right side out and pull them onto the doll. Attach golden ribbon to the center. Glue heels made from a wooden skewer and paint them black. Put the cape onto the doll. Attach the rings on the wrists by removing the hands. Glue the cape ribbon around the neck. Add a red rhinestone to the seam. Cut a crown from black cardboard. Hot glue wire as a fastening to the edges. Cover the eyes with white acrylic paint completely. Coat the lips with a black watercolor pencil. The girls get scared and turn off the TV. Nice try. That won't help because Storm is already here. The weather in the house gets worse immediately. Jessica is terrified. Where should we hide from this disaster? But Samantha calms her friend down. It's just a Storm doll. She won't hurt you. But it does look as scary as a real X-Men movie heroine. Samantha is sleeping and Jessica is saving the world. She's pretending that she's Wonder Woman. Her mission is to guard the kitchen. But Jessica lacks some superhero skills. She can't handle this sword. Don't be sad, my friend. Take this Wonder Woman doll mascot. Rub baby powder into the doll's head. It will remove grease from her hair. Wash the hair with shampoo a few times. Brush. Blow dry. Then hairspray it. Cut a top and shorts from balloons. Cut Wonder Woman costume pieces from a foam rubber sheet. Hot glue the pieces together and assemble a skirt. Attach a belt. Cut out her iconic costume details. Paint them gold. Hot glue them to the skirt and the top. Attach wire to the back of a crown base. Put it onto the head. Decorate it with a little star. Cut long balloons at an angle. Pull them onto the legs as boots. Shape heels from polymer clay. Put them onto the boots and make imprints. Bake them following the clay instructions. Glue the heels to the boots. Color them with acrylic paint. Make cuffs from silver cardboard. Attach them with double-sided tape. Make a lasso from a golden chain. Hot glue it to the belt. Define the lips with a red watercolor pencil. Apply blush with pink pastel. Wonder Woman will give you superpowers and help you believe in yourself. Just take a look at how confident she is. Jessica cheers up right away. She keeps on training. And Wonder Woman helps her. Did you like our superhero dolls? Then comment below which one you'll transform your old doll into. And don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and click on the bell 
so you don't miss any new doll ideas from Troom Troom.